Hello everybody and welcome to this video in our series about graph data science. In this video we're going to learn about graph search algorithms. And there are two graph search algorithms that we're going to cover. And while you can use these algorithms on their own, they're often used as a component in other algorithms. Um, so there are two of them, so we've got breadth first search and we've got depth first search. So let's go into each of those individually. Uh, so breadth first search is the idea that we start from a particular node, and so usually you'd specify that node, and then it explores all of its neighbours at one hop away, and it explores all those, then it comes back and it explores those at two hops away, and so on, until it's covered. I mean, I, if everything was connected, it would cover the whole graph, but as much of the graph as it can reach. And so you can see on this diagram on the right-hand side, it numbers the, the, the order in which these nodes are visited. So we go, we start at number one, and we visit everything one hop away. Then we go back, we visit the things at two hops away, and then finally we finish off with the things three hops away. Now, this algorithm, as I say, can be used for, in, in lots of other uh, algorithms, usually more goal-oriented algorithms. So, for example, it can be used as part of a shortest path uh, query, or, or it could be used to define the maximum flow in a flow network, or equally, it can be used as a component in a, in a garbage collection network where we want to start from the live objects and go and find out like what are the other um, objects that reference this one. Uh, now let's have a look at the other one. So depth first search is the other you know, graph traversal or graph search algorithm. And this one has a slightly different approach. So again, we're starting from a node and we're trying to go as far out into the graph as we can, potentially covering the whole graph. But this time we go all the way down as far as we can from our neighbor. So we start with our first neighbor and we go down and down and down as far as we can. So you can see on this one, we start at the top and then we go down to our first neighbor, we go down to its neighbor, then to its neighbor. And then we backtrack up again and then we do the same thing um, back at the, the previous level. Uh, and again, this one is usually used as part of other um, algorithms rather than on its own. So strongly connected components and connected components algorithms can both use uh, depth first search. Uh, and it was orig originally created uh, to, to solve mazes, uh, but it also can be used to, to generate those mazes as well. And so that's the end of our video on graph search algorithms. And hopefully now you have a good understanding of what is one of the fundamental building blocks of the graph algorithms field.